Mozilla Firefox offers many safety and usability advantages over other web browsers, but this week I discovered a couple of more tips that I want to share with you regarding Firefox. I learned how to make better use of my bookmarks with tools that are already built in to the Firefox browser. Firefox calls them custom keywords, and this is how you use them. First of all, you want to bring your bookmarks up on the sidebar. You can do that one of two ways by clicking View, Sidebar, and then Bookmarks, or you can use the Control B shortcut shown here. And this is just an additional tip here. If you've not noticed on the sidebar that you can search your bookmarks by just using the little built in search box right on your bookmarks. That's a very handy thing in and of itself. But back to the custom keywords. So let's say I want to visit the Ubuntu website more often than I currently do, but instead of having to hunt through them in my bookmarks, I'd like to get to the Ubuntu website very quickly just by typing in a keyword. So I'm going to click Ubuntu Forums and make sure that is the site I want to get to. And once I click on the bookmark, I want to create a keyword for it. So I'm going to right click on the bookmark here in my sidebar, go to Properties, and you'll see under the Properties, not only can I rename the Ubuntu forums, I don't need to do that, but I can add a keyword. So in this case, I'm going to add UF for Ubuntu forums. Now watch what happens. If I'm on another website, instead of having to go to my bookmarks and find that or even search for that for that particular bookmark, I can click one time in the address bar to highlight what's there, type in my new keyword that I just created, UF, and hit enter, and Mozilla Firefox knows what I'm talking about. So let's do one more. I'm going to do one for the weather underground. I'm going to pull up my bookmarks again using Control B in my sidebar here, and then I'm going to type in weather to search. There's my weather underground. I'm going to right click on it, go to properties, I currently do not have a keyword, so I'm going to call this one WU for Weather Underground. Click OK. Now when I type in my address bar, WU, and hit Enter, it takes me to the Weather Underground. But we're going to take this a step further. I don't go to the Weather Underground to see their homepage. I go to check weather at a place I'm traveling to or check my local weather. So I'm going to type in a city or a zip code. I'll put in my local zip code, and I get my local weather. But now, the thing that you want to do, though, is look up back up here in the address bar at the very end of the address. And you'll notice on any type of a site where a search has occurred, you're usually going to get something at the end of the address bar that shows you that it made a query or a questioned the website. So in this case, on Weather Underground, it says query and then the zip code I put in. So what we're going to do is create, we're going to use this bookmark. I'm going to highlight all of the address, go to Edit and Copy or again control C. I'm going to reopen my bookmarks, search again for the weather. I'm going to right click on Weather Underground, go to Properties. I'm going to change this location or this address here to from their main website to a query. But I don't always want it to be my local one. The custom keywords in Mozilla Firefox will let me replace that with a wildcard. A wildcard in this case is percent %s as in Sam there, and the percent %s will allow me to type anything I want after my keyword, and it'll search that site. So I'm going to go back here to Woot, and now I'm going to type in my keyword, Weather Underground, WU, and this time I'm going to put a space, San Diego, California, and we're going to see what happens. I'll hit Enter, and lo and behold, Weather Underground comes up, and I get the San Diego website forecast. Watch this video a couple of times to get the technique down, but once you learn how to use custom keywords, I think you're going to find yourself bookmarking and utilizing your bookmarked websites more and more.